Y'all think I don't read the comments? I actually do. I've seen a few comments from my subscribers and they're wondering why the hell I have not reacted to Larray in a while. Truth be told, he lives in that little TikTok house, you know, full of TikTokers and that's not my thing. But he finally did a video alone, so this video I will react to. For all of you LeRae fans, thank you guys so much for sticking around even though I have not reacted to him in a minute. And LeRae, I really hope you still watch my videos. You did comment that you love my videos, so I hope you didn't give up on me neither. Alright you guys, so LeRae uploaded a video called Responding to Hate Comments. Mm. I get a lot of those. I'm pretty sure you get it a whole lot more. You do have 8 million subscribers, so are y'all ready to react? Cause I am. Let's get it. Okay. Oh, okay. That got me fucked up. <laughs> Hold on. Vlog number five. Hey, this is. How are you? Um, it's me, Larray. Oh my god, sidetrack. The other day I got a comment telling me to straighten my hair. And I have never in my life straightened my hair before, so I wanted to see what the fuck was gonna happen. I knew there wasn't anything good that was gonna happen out of that because bitch, look at me. Cause you're not that cute and your hair is uneven. You look dusty. Nothing ever good happens to me. You better I just stop. Felt it was time. I felt like it was like something I had to do. I'm gonna stop him right there. Bitch, this should have been the last thing you did. <laughs> you did do it? <laughs> you did straighten your hair? Oh my god, your hair is actually long. Boy. And it's not bad. You just gotta style it. I don't know in what way, but. You could have figured it out. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, it's giving very much. Into pieces, this is my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing, don't I give a fuck. This is going to be a responding to Actually, love that song. video. <laughs> So back in the day when my YouTube journey just started, you know, I was new to the block. I didn't really receive much hate, but then, you know, I started hanging out with um, the. And let's just say it just went down from there. But no, seriously, no matter who you- Wait, the what? Because I missed it. I couldn't really hear what you said. But then, you know, I started hanging out with um, the- But no, seriously, no matter who you are or what you do, people are going to find a reason not to like you and Always. talk shit about you. That's how life works. It's fucking weird. See, I don't really feel- Always. And the crazy thing is, a lot of my haters continue to watch my videos. They kind of like me just a little bit. It's still support nonetheless, so y'all are welcome. Hey, you know, I'm really all about focusing on the positive things, which is y'all, and I know how this is gonna sound corny as f I literally would not be here without y'all. Like, I would probably be, like, in college depressed or something, but <laughs> now I'm, like, a YouTuber depressed, but it's okay. But I really do appreciate the love and support, and I know this is soft, and I hate being soft because I hate showing emotion, but honestly, really appreciate y'all because y'all literally bring me happiness when I'm fucking sad, and I'm always sad, and I'm more confident in myself than I've ever been, and that's, that's only because of y'all. Like, you literally tell me that I'm pretty every day, even though I know you're lying, because I'd be looking like shit, and y'all be like, yeah, it's queen, slay, prayer, my mom. <laughs> but before I even, uh, do I even have to say it? I feel like we're here. You know, we see each other. Yeah, see, a little good. bit. Okay, we good. I see, we see each other. We see each other. <laughs> You've been here multiple times. You know the drug guys. Sorry about that. Let's go. Gas it. It's 11.36 a.m. I need something to wake me up, but I want something biting. I need some, like, Conan Gray, like, Casey Musgraves up in this bitch. I want something indie. <laughs> Can we just all agree that the world is just so negative? I feel like we need to spread mm. more positivity in this world, you know mm. what I mean? So do your part today and just comment down that I look pretty. Hey, check this <laughs> you out. You pretty. Boxing match, right? Pay-per-view and all of that. And the first opening match is me versus James Charles. Now, I want all the sisters smoke. There, I said it. That's not even the main pitch, ready? Then the second final match, Miss Olivia Rodrigo versus Sabrina Carpenter. I want to see it. There, I said it. I don't know if their beef is real or if this is like a PR stunt, but I will say, and I'm biased because I like both of them so fucking much. If I made a song pouring out my heart, talking about some, that blonde bitch made me insecure, and then the blonde bitch made a song. Listen. Too, and I did. What about it? And I still got your man. <gasps> Listen. Miss Olivia, if you don't get your driver's license, get in your vehicle and run that bitch over. I'm just thinking like if I- I have no clue what the hell he's talking about right now. Are they TikTokers? Cause if they are, that's why I don't know. So I apologize, I cannot comment on anything that he just said right now. Olivia and someone made a song like that about me. Oh, I would be driving past your street. <laughs> mm -hmm, I would drive past and then it would turn into a drive by. Wait. Guys, let me go. Let me go. I'm gay. 
and black. And black, okay. Both. I want to see you dance, Lorraine. I haven't seen you dance in a while. Hi, we're home. How are you? I'm Larry. Nice to what? You want to know who the guy is? I already tried to film this video. If you don't believe me, check this out. You see this? This is me, two days ago, trying to film this exact video, but you want to know why I didn't get to finish it? Why? Bitch, I'm a motherfucking cancer. I am a cancer, which means, uh, wait, why am I literally being that bitch? Oh my gosh. I'm literally that bitch at parties that be like, let's choose zodiac sign. I'm a Gemini, my rising's a Virgo. Like, shut up. But no, seriously, I'm a cancer, so my feelings can hurt a little bit. Bitch, it takes a lot to hurt my feelings, you know, especially since I'm like, Phil? <laughs> Black. It takes a lot to just really- No, that's true. When it comes to cancer, that they're sweet and everything. But it takes a lot for them to really blow up. But when they blow up though, they go crazy. They go hard. They go aggressive. See, my daddy's a cancer. He's a sweet man. The sweetest man you'll ever meet. But I've seen him angry a few times and it's scary. Mm. Get me there because bitch, I have a lot of trauma in the back of my head. So I'm a strong bitch. My trauma has me strong and ready to go. But yesterday when I was filming this video, I stumbled across a comment uh -huh. in that comment. Said, is it just me or the ray looks like a shrimp that shops at urban outfitters what what does that even mean how does shrimp that shops at urban outfitters this bitch but i'm past that you know i'm all about <laughs> picking a leap and moving forward so we're going to continue this video we're going to retry it and this time i'm going to try not to get my feelings hurt so let's begin here we go oh i think she just gave me a all, I want all the viewers to understand that we get used to getting negative comments. It's just part of the process. So we know what we signed up for. So when we get those negative comments, it all depends on how we react to it. As for me, sometimes when I see a paragraph and I read the first two sentences, if, it, if it's negative, most likely, I'm not going to continue reading it. It's for my sanity, you know, it's for my mental health. I would never want to keep reading something so negative about me when this person doesn't even know me personally. So why would I put myself through that? You get what I'm saying? But there are a couple comments that I do read fully and completely and it makes me want to like comment back and correct them because most of the time they're wrong in what they're saying. But then I have to check myself and be like, they're probably just kids. They don't know any better. And if they are adults, they still don't know any better. So ignore it and move on. So that's what we do. That's what us YouTubers do. We do have feelings. We're not robots. There's going to be a few times where we're going to get our feelings hurt. That's normal. But this is when we have to check ourselves and be like, eh, let's keep it pushing. Let's keep working on our craft. But one day I do want to read hate comments as soon as I get a lot more. <laughs> as soon as I get a lot more hate comments, I will do a video like this. Thank you. He looks like the gay Emily Chopper. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like the gay Emily Chopper. I mean, let me ask the audience. Like, you don't know um, who Emily Chopper is. He's you like do. One of those, like, you know what I'm talking about? No. Like, those, you know? He's like a hood rapper or something. You sound like a girl. It's disgustingly annoying. Is this better for you? Yeah. Bitch, I'm going from Lorraine to corpse. Back it up, Dark Vader. You're too gay. Bitch, your name is Jakeisha. Shut up. Bitch, I may be gay, but at least my name doesn't sound like an STD. Wait, okay, I feel bad now. Suck a dick and die. Goddamn. Ogie, okay. girl, I'm gay. That's like telling me to breathe. He likes that shit. <laughs> I can't stand this ugly, dumb, gay bitch. You know what? I may be <laughs> ugly, dumb, and a bitch, but I am not gay. What? What? Yeah. <laughs> so wrong. Redo. You know what? I may be a dumb, gay, ugly bitch. Wait, what? Oh. Fuck you. Oh, this is great. <laughs> The black people versus Fuck you. charges, whitewash, tell me black friend, being unfunny. Verdict. Damn. Guilty as fuck. Damn. Case closed, next case. So I came across this Reddit page. It's like a thread of people just having conversations about topics. And the topic of this thread is my lovely scrumptious white Caucasian white man John Smith's boyfriend in the other room. Hey baby, I love you. The conversation of the thread is basically about how attractive my boyfriend is. But then it turns into a thread constantly bashing me for my looks and why he's with me. But, Damn. Um, yeah. Somebody posted on this thread. His, his boyfriend is really handsome. I don't know if y'all seen him. Brady, he's a very handsome man. But Lorraine's cute too, okay? Not everybody's gonna be attracted to everybody. I think everyone is beautiful in their own way. Stop being a hater, y'all. Shit. Brady loves him. That's what it is. managed to snatch such a snack. He's ugly. And then someone quote tweeted that response and said, Money and internet fame. Damn. 
This motherfucker is way too sexy to be clapping the cheeks of that ugly ass bitch Lorraine. Let what me just hate give a shout to every single gay on this website that are constantly bashing me for my looks and my relationship. There's a huge difference between y'all and me. And that is, while you guys are sitting on this page worried about my relationship, uh -huh. I'm sitting somewhere else, preferably a Quite frankly, we aren't the same, and most definitely not in the same tax bracket. So, uh. enjoy sleeping alone tonight. Mm. Good luck on Grindr. Trump oh. hates gays. Trump also lost. Uh. This reminds me of Okay, that sucks. I hate that. Most of his hate comments is homophobia. Like, what's wrong with y'all? And and this is so sad because me as a lesbian woman, I get a couple of those comments, but rarely. It's harder for a gay man, and uh, that sucks, Lori. I hate that you have to read shit like this. I don't like that. Charles. Hey, hey, straight boys, up here. I understand your brain capacity can only take so much of the gay community because you have the brain size of a fucking pea. Just because a homosexual man talks flamboyant or wears makeup doesn't make him James Charles. Oh my God. Right. Uh, going so dumb. Like, what if I just kept putting straight men in the same category as a pile of shit? And they are the same bitch. Oh. I know he's black, but he's giving very much Michael Jackson tees. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know how y'all enjoy his content. He's so annoying. Huh? I don't that think so. That's so cute. The forehead reveal, damn. <laughs> Every day I'm getting comments about wanting a forehead reveal. I feel like I can't be 100% authentic with y'all if I'm just not living my true self. So I feel like it's just time at this point. And I feel like we're family now. So I'm gonna do it. You know, fuck it. I'm gonna, what? We'll send it, you know? Um, oh, hey. oh. You gonna show us Le Ray Ray? I'm actually gonna do it. Let me One, see it, Le Ray Ray. Two. You ain't gonna do it. Ah! This is crazy. <laughs> you ain't gonna One, do it. Two, three. I knew it. <laughs> he always so puts. I'm really the fact that Yo, Isa hold on, my space bar ain't working again. I love when he shows Jeffrey Star randomly in his videos. It's just funny. Hang out with Charlie D'Amelio and James Star. <laughs> 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 Let me clear this narrative because a lot of people think I ditched him to go hang out with that hype out bitch. He still lived back at home to go focus on himself and be near his family, and we're still best friends. We still talk every day, weirdos. Ravon, where's Issa? Um, are we still friends? <laughs> yeah, we talk to him every day. Now shut up! Is it just me or the right? And that sucks though. Like, oh, I want I love your videos together. I wish you guys were still able to film together because th those were the best ones. Y'all both can dance. Y'all both funny as hell. Y'all both bully each other. That's the type of content I like to see. But it's okay though. Let's see a little bit of Larray Ray. So is it just me or Larray got super unfunny and annoying after the he joined the hype house? Ooh, I'm not gonna say that. I, I know this is the reason why I stopped reacting to him, but it's not because he's unfunny or annoying. It's the fact that the people around him in the hype house are unfunny and annoying. <laughs> That's why I don't watch it. But Larray still Larray. After he joined the Hype House, just say you hate the Hype House and go about your day. I'm yeah. gonna say this one time and one time only. I am still the same bitch. No amount of money, no amount of clout, no amount of anybody can change that. Mm. The only thing that has changed about me is that I'm growing up as an adult and I have baby fever. That's literally it. Uh -huh. <laughs> is it just me or Lorraine turned white? He is half white, ain't he? How the fuck I did that? You know what? <laughs> if the internet says I'm white, bitch, I must be white. So it's no longer Lorraine to y'all. It's Lance, the third I told her. <laughs> Lorraine, I'm not gay, but I totally will let you eat my... Okay. Ooh. You know what? We're done for today. <laughs> <laughs> Best friend of the tour. Who this is? <laughs> okay, Lorraine. Who the fuck is T? See you next week. What's T mean? I don't know what that means. Hi. What does your hoodie say? Oh, oh my God. looks so cute. I will. That's fucking cute as fuck. Thank you so much. You have a great day, okay? How many say? Check this. <laughs> Hi, Hi how are you? Of, of course. Oh. Okay, ready? Oh my god, Nice to you. meet you. How are you? How are you? I'm doing amazing. Hi, I'm Larry. Nice to meet you. Can you say hi to Caitlin and Linda? Hi, Caitlin and Linda. Hope you guys. Hope you have an amazing day. And Melanie and um and Melanie, like Martina? Yeah. Hi, Melanie. How are you? I love you. Thank you so much. Of course, you have a great day. Oh, and Nina. And Nina. Oh, girl. Thank you. Bye. Girl, let Thank him go. So nah, let him go. like that. <laughs> Me you don't know? I like Larray. Hopefully one day I get to meet him. I don't get starstruck. I ain't nobody's fan. But at the same time, I respect certain people. And Larray is one of them. So I would hope for one day to meet him. And Larray, if you is watching this video, please comment below because I haven't heard from you in a minute. So it'd be nice. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Tell me what you thought about this video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please hit that bell. 
so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.